<laughs> Got anything to say? No? Yeah, no. compassionate, caring human beings of this planet. What are we doing? Yeah, that's enough. Sort yourself out. Hey, <laughs> humans, sort yourself out. That's exactly. the message. Bye. We're enslaving humans. <laughs> the reason we're going to keep it simple is because... Because everybody already knows what's going on. It's quite clear in the media and we all know that, you know, animals being born into captivity purely for the purposes of our taste pleasure. We all know it, no one wants to look at the slaughterhouse footage, no one wants to acknowledge it, you know, what goes on in the slaughterhouses, is that God's work or is it the devil's work? So only one answer there, you want to be involved in that? Do you? We don't have to anymore, we don't have to anymore, we've been brought up to think that, you know, that's normal, 
and that's just what people do. We don't need to do it anymore. It's very easy to be hey. vegan in the UK. Very exactly, easy. it's easy, but I don't, no excuse. I'm not saying it's expecting people just to go vegan overnight. It's a journey, it's a journey for me. Some people will do it. But just start investigating for yourself and stop listening to the bullshit. Well, just think about it from take a moral action perspective. In your daily life. Think about it from yeah. a moral perspective. Yeah. You know, if you're against animal abuse, you know, if you've got a dog or a pet or something like that, how would you feel if they got run over or something? You feel bad. What's going on here? Exactly. Well, yeah, well, got distracted, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, this isn't anger, this is passion. This so. is passion, this, this is, is pure passion. passion. Don't right? mistake. There's no excuse for animal abuse. And that's what you see here, all these people feel the same. The world is a changed place. If you can't get your head around that, you might want to try it. Right, start getting your head around it. Next time you're in your shop or in your supermarket, just make a better decision. Don't walk down the meat aisle. Look, if all these people can do it, you know, and survive. They're not getting ill, they've just walked five miles shouting their heads off. They're really fit and healthy. And it's not about health, it's about the animals, okay? Health is just a bonus. This is always about the animals. Animal rights come first. If you can't get your head around that, then the chances are you'll never get your head around children's rights or human rights. And they don't know anything else. They ain't never seen the sun shine. They ain't never seen the sun shine. I'm talking about babies being stolen from their mothers. Mothers being forcibly impregnated until they can't do it anymore. And then what happens? They get dragged off to the slaughterhouse, bolt gunned in the head, and their throat slit. Do you want to be part of that? Do you want to be part of this suffering? Are you against animal abuse? It's a simple question that we all ask ourselves. been handed this a can of the goose so apparently it's a High Court Justice Queen's Bench Division decision something to do with um, protesting outside Canada goose hang on Yeah, so outside Canada Goose, um, High Court injunction, there's black tape on the pavement from where you can stand, right, and shout. But you're not allowed to use your megaphone where the black tape is on the floor. Um, I filmed my little speech. Uh, but the good thing is, is my voice is louder than the megaphone, so I just stood there and shouted, really. I think Swayze's got some footage of that. I'm not sure. I didn't because I was busy being recorded by them on their phone. So if it was a Canada Goose work phone, um, like Canada Goose, you're nasty, aren't you? Um, and if it was the guy's work phone, then our uh, personal phone rather, then I hope you upload it to your YouTube page, mate, and I hope you upload it to your Facebook page, and you so people you know where you work is a shop that abuses animals, yeah? So you might say, yeah, I'm just making a living, bruv. Yeah, well, animals are being abused. They ain't making a living, man. That ain't even 21st century, is it? So, you know, just once again, we said it before, we said it again, just sort your shit out, because low-level attitudes and behaviour, like the guy at speech at um, Trafalgar Square today, like, come on, like, stop the racism. Stop the we're all not united crap. We are very united, you know? Like, and by the way, there were nothing to do with the vegan protest. That was another event taking place at Trafalgar Square, right? But just generally, society, the, sh the stuff you're talking, it's shit. It's complete shit. It's such low level shit. You have no idea how much shit you are actually talking. 
so please just sort your shit out. Thanks.